Generic greetings and welcome to Escapes Plus Prison Architect once again. This is our Alpha 35 prison. Because we've been blasting through the campaign as of late and not doing a construction uh, series properly, I thought, you know, we'll mix it up a bit and we'll do another escape attempt. Or we'll at least try to break out with this thing. Uh, I guess that's what an escape attempt is. As I said, this is our Alpha 35 prison. I'm just going to be going back through some of my old prisons, but this is the one that um, was quite run of the mill, but, uh, you know, it was um, a good prison, I thought. It, it did look quite good. Uh, we've currently got uh, Bernard here. Uh, Bernard? Bernard, whatever. Uh, prisoner number 457529, as you can see. There we go. Uh, we've got like a little goatee there. Quite cool. Right, and we can do a little dance. <laughs> Escape mode's one of those ones where, as I said, it's, uh, I've said it several times before, it's, it's one of those, oh, as soon as you realise it's in, you go, well, that's a logical thing. Oh, you can actually turn around and um, see his crack. Uh, yeah, so it's a logical thing when you when you when you hear about it and when you see it. But it's such a great addition to the game. Like it really does give you a massive sort of, I wouldn't say a boost, but it's like it just breathes a whole new uh, like like level into it. You know, it gives it a, more life, but also gives you like say a whole new level of. Um, Attempting things because you can build a prison then attempt from escape from it and you'll learn from both sides of it You see and also you can obviously instead of just loading other people's prisons and just going there you go because at the generally Generally when you build something the objective is to build something or right? whatever your objective is whether to build a really good prison a crap prison Just the biggest prison whatever right and just you know it's about the about the journey of doing that and then now you can escape from it you know, the whole point is you can actually build up towards escaping and running away from it, which is, uh, you know, a whole different kettle of fish. There's, um, there's a gang member looking at me there. This is the gang prison, as far as I'm aware. It's got a lot of gang members in it. Yeah, we've got it, it, it sort of individual um, rooms, and there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of gang members in this prison, and I don't know like how many I uh, how many we can actually get but either way I, like I don't know how many we've actually got in here I've just realized all the cells have currently got no flooring in as well that's uh, how it was come on do you want to just take me to my cell I don't know which uh, gang I'm uh, gang area I'm gonna go into now it would be good if they expand this so you can actually make your own gang or be join a gang and like work your way up the ladder to become the gang leader and order the gangs and do plays and stuff like that you can sort of do that when you get reputation and move people about but either way uh, it would be good to see this expand. I mean, this is like a great addition, but obviously it would be nice to see it uh, go even further. So anyway, I've finally been put into my cells. I've actually got a very long cell, which I really appreciate. Thank you, uh, Mr. Barraclough. We're going to go down now, and we're going to head to the canteen, because that's where hopefully people are. So as I said, escape attempt here. How are we going to escape? Well, because of where we are, we could easily tunnel out. We did do a blitz attempt in the last... Uh, can you open this door, someone? No. Uh, we did do a blitz attempt and actually a successful uh, blitz attempt it was. We did successfully manage to... Where's he taking me? Oh, it's lock up now. Now, now it's lock up time. Well, thanks for that. Um, <laughs> great. My own regime's working against me. Um, yes, as I said. Oh, and I've also got some mail. Oh, I just punched some mail. Oops, I didn't want to do that. Um, I've just been knocked out. <laughs> well, I, I didn't want to punch the mail. I thought oh, I'll pick it up but I left clicked which is actually attack and then I just started punching some mail and now I've got nine hours in uh, in lock up. Uh, it's, well, it's lock up and um, solitary which is great but I've got two reputation points. <laughs> oh good grief. <laughs> anyway what was I on about? Um, <laughs> oh god I can't remember now. Oh actually I've now got some gang tats. How's this worked out? I've actually been recruited into a gang. How on earth is it? Does it tell me? No, it doesn't tell me there. Um, I've got no reputation as far as I can tell for gangs. So I'm now in a gang, right? This is... <laughs> <laughs> oh, good grief. Well, so I'm now in a gang. I don't know what gang. I don't know whether it's blue, red or green gang. It doesn't tell me. And there's nowhere as far as I can tell uh, for me to access that. So, um... I'm not going to say alpha game is still alpha, but um, <laughs> version 1.0 game is uh, still not finished. Oh, it was bound to happen. It was bound to happen when you add a sort of brand new feature and you get, uh, you know, it's in such an expansive game. 
Anyway, uh, yeah, what was on about Sca- escape attempts? The last episode, or the last time we attempted uh, uh, an escape episode, we managed to successfully escape, and we did a blitz out, and it worked. We could tunnel out because of where we are. As you can see, we're very close. I'll speed up to max speed here. We're very close to the edge of the uh, the wall, but I don't know if we want to do that one. I'm going to try. I'm going to try bring uh, probably a lot of people into my, uh, I guess, collective. Um, I guess, personal sort of gang. And um, we'll see how far we go with that one. I'm just going to go to reputations. I can get some different reputations here. I'm going to go for... Um, deadly. And I'm going to go for... Probably... Um, strong. So, you hit hard with each punch and you're deadly. Which you're a master of lethal combat moves and can sometimes kill with a single hit. I'm going to try and go for... I'm going to do, I'm going to do a very, very violent uh, thing. I'm going to do very, go very sort of violent and basically try to... Punch, 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 punch. Get loads of rep by killing uh, people, and then bring them up and basically get all of the traits, or at least some of the traits, and go that way. Obviously, it's currently sleep time, but um, I'm currently I'm locked in here. In here. I can't uh, be. I can't go violent. I don't actually have any needs. I've just realised if you look at the back, you got like a. Let's have a quick look. Like looks like you got a compass on the back of my head. North, south, <laughs> north, south, uh, east, west on the back of my head. <laughs> oh, good grief. Right, so I'm just running around here. Two hours until I've uh, exited this thing. You can... What's that? Remove squad member. Oh, yes, you can remove uh, people from your squad. And the first time... Obviously... <laughs> the first time I ever tried this... I ever tried the escape attempt, I went... Oh, look, you can dis... Uh, you, can, you can remove a squad member. You can remove yourself from your squad. I did that, and the game goes... Brrr, end. Oh, failure. Well, then. That didn't work out, did it? Um... <laughs> <laughs> That's interesting. <clears throat> Thanks very much, game. Anyway, just waiting for this to finish. It looks like I'm now actually out. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm. I think I'm actually out of this one. I'm going to be brought back to my cell, which apparently is down here. Ah, I've been moved cell for some reason. I don't know why that is. Maybe this is. Maybe this is the green cell block. Maybe that's why I've been moved down here, and there's a lot of, uh, oh, not green, sorry, uh, maybe this is one of the gang cell blocks, because I did section off and move them around, although I don't think there's anything in the game to really do that. Um, or, because that was a slightly larger cell, because I attacked someone, I then got reduced to a grade zero cell, that's what I was worthy of, so maybe that's why I'm here. Um, I could attack something here, which I'm not going to do that, I'm going to sleep, and then go to the next morning, which is actually, there you go, job done. It is now free time, we can run around. So what am I going to do? I'm going to run around, I'm not going to attack that guy there. There's another gang member, if I want to, I can attack him, and then that'll probably go quite badly. Um... What I want to do really is get a weapon and I want to start attacking people. So let's just take a quick stock of this. Now, one of the things that I realized is that, um, and I've, d I've done this with a couple of other prisons, is that the older the prison, the better it is, right? Not in terms of, you know, security, because the problem, I guess the problem is that I generally make okay prisons. <laughs> and it's quite hard to escape from prisons that I've um, done quite well on. But what I mean is, the older the prison, the better, because I don't remember it, right? So I don't think this prison has a workshop, and workshop obviously has a really big um, contraband... Uh, a workshop has a really big sort of contraband, not intake, but do you know what I mean? It, it's got like a... It, there's a lot of stuff you can get in there that's uh, violent. I'm just going to keep running around in here, and I have to be very careful. This is the mail room, and I'm trying to find... I'm going to the shop. All of this I can work in, you see, so there's no reason why I can't wander around here. Sims reception. Um, I can't go into... That's dodgy. That says I can't get access to that storage. It doesn't say anything about. No, that's a staff door. No, I can't go in there. Looks like we've got more intake as well. I don't know what the game's uh, intake is set to. Either way, I'm trying to run around and I'm trying to get some sort of uh, implement to attack someone with. I guess in here there's not going to be much contraband at all. No, no. What I want to do, I want to find... Is that a facing game? It is a facing game. No hands in game, though. <laughs> I want to find... I want to, I want to take someone out. I want to find a weapon. What's in here? Cigarettes, other stuff. You know what? I could just attack this guy. Bang! Dead. Alright, so I've killed... I've killed one member there. Oh my good grief! Um, I've just managed to kill... Three people! Oh my good grief! <laughs> and I'm still attacking. Still going on here. <laughs> well, um, I've been... Knocked unconscious. Well, 
I've been knocked unconscious, but as you can see, I've just got 16 reputation points. <laughs> I went in this office. Bang! Absolutely destroyed the psychologist. Went in here, went to the two doctors and went, job done. There's another two down. Um, I've probably got, yeah, I've got 24 hours in lockdown. I'm going to go to reputation. I'm going to get tough. I'm going to get, oh, you can actually get even further. Hit side of the beach, punch. I'm going to get instigator and skilled fighter. So you can actually increase that even further. Deadly? Yeah. So I'm, I'm now max deadly. Oh, that's a much better name. <laughs> this guy's now max deadly. I'm going to get sprint because why not? Seven more reputation points. I'm going to um, wait until I'm in here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip with my reputation. Uh, spend some of your reputation to get, remove your squad from, from this thing. So I'm going to get put in here. Obviously, I'm injured. Slight problem here. I can't actually get healed because um, I killed the doctors. I never thought about that. That's um, really shooting yourself in the foot, pretty much. Or stabbing the doctor in the face. Uh, let's skip my... Skip punishment. There we go. So that cost me one reputation point. I'm now in here. Ah, but I'm fully healed. That's okay. So what do I want to do? Well, what I want to do, I want to start recruiting people. So this guy's throwing up. I don't think he's going to be a good contender. Um, reputation point seven. Um, it's a cost. You can see on the cost on the right-hand side there. But he doesn't have any good um, traits. Paul Whiteman. It's currently work time. So let's go in here. Could attack the dog. Probably not a good idea. Let's sprint. Way we can sprint. And obviously I'm deadly as a fighter. I could do some more attacking. What if I attack that shotgun guard down there? What if I take him out? Would I actually get... Um... J, that guy there. Scott J. Unknown reputation. Scott, reputation 7 to do that. Hmm. What I want to do... Ah. I want to take someone out that's quite easy. <laughs> it's quite easy. Sprint, 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 sprinting, sprinting. Da down, and then dog's dead. Oh my good grief! This guy is really deadly, isn't he? When he starts going for it, there's a shotgun. Okay, and let's just press the space. <laughs> Didn't even press the space there. I just putting my hands up and going, you know what? Yeah, we'll call that a day. Thanks, guys. I don't think I want to do that one. Honestly, this <laughs> that guy there, Mr. Fellows. Oh, looks like uh, it does actually hire back stuff. Look, there's a medical person. And I'm going to get medical up. Hi, doctor. Thank you for the heal. I promise I won't attack you. Yet. <laughs> Twitchy. <laughs> right, okay. Anyway, reputation points 13. Um, that deadly is really... It is really deadly, isn't it? Uh, reputation. I've got deadly. Um, I want to get... Probably... I want to get maxed out strong. And then... Maxed out tough, right? And then I'm going to... I've got 18 hours... To stay in lockup. Actually, where am I being brought to here? I'm brought up. I'm gonna bring. Well, I'm getting brought to this lockup. We're in here now, and we're gonna go for a skip of punishment. It's only gonna cost one to do that. That's fine. Uh, we are now still in lockup. It's lockup time, which is five o'clock, and now we can come back out. So I don't want to keep doing this. Well, I think I actually want to bring. I don't know. I really want to get a shotgun, and the only way to get a shotgun is to take this guy out here. I am deadly, so I can take him out fairly fast. What's in here? Nothing. If I wait for that guy to patrol up there, up there, and then attack this guy, I might be able to take him out with one or two punches. But then if I attack him, I see I was going to get a big lump of, uh, a lot of lump of people, but I'm thinking just to go, nah, that didn't work out at all. I just got tasered. Yeah, um, even being tough, uh, sometimes withstand taser hits, that didn't work out. Didn't work out, but the shotgun is on the ground though, which is an interesting one. Um, looks like they've just bagged up the shotgun. <laughs> oh, what happened there? That'll have been skilled fighter. This prisoner is skilled in defensive combat. You can disarm his opponent or even take the weapon from them in a fight. So that's what's happened there, you see. I've actually attacked him and uh, obviously got that uh, shotgun off him. If I didn't get tasered, then I'd be okay. You can imagine what this game is like if you didn't have tasers. This would be... Why is there a door opening closing there? I'm going to skip the punishment again. You can imagine what it would be like with uh, that sort of thing. Uh, with that sort of uh, setup where you don't have any... Um, what you call it? Can I re recruit that guy? I'm going to recruit this guy, Mr. Ward. Now they're mad. So you can actually give him uh, reputation stuff as well. 
Mm. Deadly. Right. Uh, yeah, you can actually. Um... Uh, sorry, sorry. What was on? Yeah, the uh, the the whole uh, fighting thing. I mean, you can. I guess if you. Um... Hang on. Where was I going? Oh yes, I'm going to go in the infirmary because I want to. Uh, I want to nick some. Uh, not bottles, I want to nick some, one of these, damn it, that's not, that's not what I, I just did a bit of a punch there, whew, okay, uh, yeah, you can imagine what the game would be like if you didn't have tasers, let's just steal this here, hiya, and then I want this guy, and we, no, no, that please, I want them, I want, I want weapons, there we go, right, so double weapons, so we're going to come over here, he's following, and, Okay, dead, dead. Come on, come on, come on, come on, shotgun. No, shotgun! Right. Get some! It does work! Right. Okay. Yeah, this does work. Oh, damn it, I've been unconscious. Ward. Um. Bloody hell. That went... That kicked off. You can't... Yeah, right, I didn't know you could get shotguns. <laughs> Good grief. Right, uh, let's just go to skip punishment. Um, it's only going to cost one. So, where is he? There's this guy here. Um, he's doing a bit of a search. Go for reputations. I want to get strong, tough, quick, instigate, a skilled fighter. We want to get... Um, I think that'll do us for now. We want to start recruiting some more people. I want to just start recruiting everybody I can. How much are you going to cost? You're going to cost eight. Why do you cost eight? I don't care. It means you're probably going to be quite good. Right. And you are now going to be strong, tough, and deadly. Right. So everybody is following, hopefully. So I'm going to whistle to him. You say toggle follow, you see. And we're going to go back up. And... Can. I've always wondered. I've always wondered. If we go inside there, do we then control... If we, can we control that? Hmm. I'm not sure. Can you just attack a wall, by the way? I've never wondered, can you just attack a wall? No, you cannot just attack a wall. Oh, you can, but it doesn't do anything, so let's not bother. Can you sprint? Oh, yes, you can. Um, okay, I've just taken that guy straight out. Let's have a set of keys. Can we use a set of keys on walls? Come on, guys. And... Huh. That's a shotgun. That's a shotgun. Uh, keep running. I'm going to try... Well, I'm, I've got a set of keys. I want to just see if these keys work. Keep running. Keep running. Nope. I've been tasered. Okay, we're on a ward now. Ward's going to keep running. And... Deadly kicked in there again, look. Keep going. Keep going. Do there's a doctor. Ah, damn it. Right, where's Pierce? Pierce is over here. Ah, it didn't work out. It didn't work out. Let's skip the punishments again. As you can see, I'm trying to just go full-on violence. And... Let's go for a sleep here. We'll go for a double sleep. Because anyway, it only sleeps till 12 and they have to wake up the next morning. Um, so, I want to get everybody follow me over here. How much to recruit that guy? 10. I really want that other guy to come here and then we'll take this guy out. To be honest with you, I'm just going to go for the full on violence now. <laughs> I don't even know if I want to escape. I just want to uh, take this guy out. Where is Pierce? He's coming. Right. Hi, Bernard. How's it going? Bang. Shotgun. I want to bring him here. And then I'm going to start fighting. Uh, I want to click on ward. I want you to go up here. And there is a taser around here. No, there's a set of keys. It's got a Bernard. And we're going to start taking stuff out. Okay. Pick up the taser, please. No, no, don't taser me, mate. You get shot in the face. Okay. And I want to go for you. I want, I want them to automatically... Pick up the taser. Taser, please. There we go. Got Bernard. And what are we attacking? Are we just attacking everything? I think we're just attacking everything. Can we recruit this guy? Uh, no, he's... I, I, basically, because of my instigator, he's now booting it off. So that's okay. Who are you? Did you just try to shoot at me? Who is that? That's one of my guys. I don't know what they're shooting at. Quick hide, 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 hide. Hey... Come on. God, this is pretty fast firing this. Oh, another guard come in. 
Ah, I think we've all been taken out. How many reputation points is that? Um. Oh my good grief. That would be 30 <laughs> odd reputation points. Right. Skip punishment uh, because there's far too much punishment to uh, keep there. Right. Let's just keep going around and this guy's going to cost four to uh, recruit. He's now ours. So follow all these. I'm going to say follow. Obviously, there's a lot of stuff for them to come around and um, <laughs> all of these. I think we'll get strong, tough, deadly on all of these and instigate a skilled fighter. We'll get all of them. Um, we're just going to keep going around. Did I set this alarm off? I don't. I might have done. There's another guy here, Noel. And what about this guy? 16 to recruit him. Okay. Interesting. What can I do now? I'm trying to think what's the best way of escaping. In fact, this is the thing. This is supposed to be escapes plus prison architect. All it's just me running around and kill things, prison architect. Um, which I don't think. Honestly, I don't think people are going to be too worried about that. Where It's free time. Where people are going to, where are people going to be in here? There's always some people in the canteen, isn't there? Can, can you open the door, please? There we go. Why am I getting searched? Ah, uh, damn it. No, there's no reason to search me. I've got nothing on me. One prisoner has been unnecessarily searched recently. Thank you. Right, okay. We'll go in here and there is one person sitting over there, which is 16. It's the same guy. This is a shame. And it, that guy's 16 as well. We can actually go in here, I believe. Yes, we can. We can go inside here because we can work inside the kitchen. This is where we'll find some knives and stuff. Right. Um, if we kill all of these, we'll get a lot of reputation. That guy's knocked out. Just take all these out. Unconscious dead. And I think there's another one dead. Oh, there's more shotguns. Come on, come on. Lunge, 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 lunge. Damn it. Okay. See, this is the thing. Once you, um take people out, eventually you are on the all, you, you basically jump to another character and we'll skip punishments. But I did get a lot more reputation there. <clears throat> Let's go for extremely deadly on each one of these. Everybody is deadly now. <laughs> like I said, I'm really trying to find, I'm really trying to find a way to escape. I mean, I could just take, I could just basically go to the front and then blast my way out. I think with all of the people we have here, we should be able to do a, a fight out. Now, I know in the previous episode, some people, uh, there was a couple of comments saying what you should do, you should actually attack everybody uh, and get as many people as you can. Um, can I recruit some of these? 23? God, look at that, 23 to recruit. Uh, they're saying you should attack, like, some people. Uh, or keep getting enough uh, reputation, sorry, um, and get... Loads and loads of people basically get the whole prison on your side. But what I'm going to do instead is blitz out. And I think we'll be able to get away with this one. Yeah, everybody's got to think. There we go. Just keep running out, lads. There's another blitz out attempt. Bang. Total score. Oh, look at the victims. Oh, my good grief. So that's 138 total score. That's a lot better than my previous one. And time taken. One day, 23 hours and 18 minutes. Actually, a lot less because I've been skipping across it. There you go. Another blitz out attempt. It's proven again that <laughs> you need to surround the external part of your prison because this is exactly what happened in the last one. But if we're honest, I didn't really want to escape. I just needed to end the video because otherwise I'm going to spend another three hours just running around and attacking people in the prison, which may become a series in itself. <laughs> As always, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks very much for watching. Comments in the comments and generic partings.